Let's do the intro. Let's do the intro. Y'all ready? Let's do the intro. Is y'all ready, though? Is y'all ready? All right. <clears throat> it's your boy, Rod! Mm-hmm. We just moved. We live in our own house. Nobody can tell, tell me to shut the fuck up now. Let's go. Jeez! Back! What's another video? <laughs> Let's go. All right, man, look. Excuse me. I just burped. Come on, bro. All right. Damn, something in my eye. Yo, who attacking me? I just had to burp and something that was in my eye at one time. Almost lost a bub to a ghost. All right, look. <clears throat> um, What about to say? Hyper as shit. Yeah, that's kind of how the intro go. We try to get as hyper as we can. That's literally the goal. I, I need to do it better, actually. Like, more hyper. Um. Anyways, though. We, let's get into the story time. Yeah, that's what we was doing. It threw me off. My mom just said, shut the fuck up. Damn. I can't ever, I can't ever chill in my, my own house. I, I'm still getting told, shut the fuck up. <laughs> it's like, nah. All right, today's story time, man. Today's story time. Y'all know how I be them little pages going around in school where they be posting shit? Y'all know what I'm talking about. They be posting little weird shit. You feel me? Try and get you canceled and shit like that. Yeah, one of them little pages, them little exposed pages. Yeah, we about to talk about it. We about to talk about it. Yeah, them little, them little school tea pages. Uh huh. Uh huh. We about to, we about to get into it though. We them one of them pages, one of them pages try to cancel me, man. One of them pages try to cancel me. You know. So we about to get straight into it, man. Y'all ready? Is y'all ready? They was ruthless. Oh, they was super ruthless. They was super ruthless. But I'm more powerful than a uh, page because every page is ran by a human. I, I will beat you the fuck up. Rod got roaches in his toothbrush in the new crib. Damn, that's crazy. That's crazy if you like roaches on a toothbrush. Are you speaking from experience? That's crazy. <laughs> Are you speaking from experience? That's really extreme. On the. <laughs> <laughs> that's extreme, bro. I'm not even going like I was about to cook you with a, like a tough response, but that's like really extreme, bro. He's speaking from like a hurt place. He's projecting right now. He's projecting. Yeah, they just be saying stuff. Yeah, he probably twelve. He he on he on some shit like yeah. Let me hurt this nigga feelings. I'm hitting with the roach, Joe. And it's really going. It's really going to cook him. The roach combo. <laughs> all right boom let's get into it y'all so if y'all don't know i feel like well no everybody should know when somebody say like yo you in your prom that mean like yo you're the best you can be you feel me that mean like you the best you can be y'all during school i had a prom i had a prom during school you feel me i had a prom during school bro you really laugh at anything I find shit funny. You probably ain't laugh because you ain't find it funny. It's kind of it's called sense of humor. But anyways, bro, I was in my prom during school. You know when I was in my prom, bro. I was in my prom when I was telling the most jokes. I had the baddest bitch. You feel me? I was in my prime. I was in my prime. I'm trying to tell you, bro. I'm trying to tell you. I was making everybody laugh. I had the baddest bitch. Not only did I have the baddest bitch. I had two bitches. Not only did I have two bitches, I had a, I had a friend group. Like, bro, I was, I was, bro, I was cooking athletes. Like, you know how athletes, I'm not gonna lie, athletes always gonna have a, a, um, a soft spot in every girl's heart. Like, it's just, I don't know what it is. It's something about a nigga shooting a ball inside a basket that just get a bitch uh, ready to fuck him. And I don't know what it is. I tried to learn this shit. I tried to learn basketball. It just didn't fucking work. It didn't work. I'm not gonna lie, it didn't work. Uh, you know, and football, I, I played football from ages five to seven, and you know, that wasn't going to work either. It didn't work when I searched up how many people make it to the NFL and the NBA, and I saw them small percentages. I'm a numbers guy, and it wasn't going to work. Anyways, I'm up there with the athletes, bro. I'm up there with the athletes, 
and I'm up there for being funny. I was in my prom. It was like it was like a whole month thing where it's just like, yo, I felt like every time I, bro, I was happy to go to school. I felt like every time I go to school, niggas was just fucking with me. Like niggas was just fucking with me. Like it was it was a thing. I'm a numbers guy. You see how I said I'm a numbers guy with this shirt. <laughs> if I never had this sh- if I never had this shirt on, I would not say I was a numbers guy. <laughs> All right, look. All right, look. All right. All right. All right, look. I'm a numbers guy. <clears throat> I'm so confused. It's cool, bro. It, it was, bro. When I say stuff, it be like, yo, if it hit, it hit. If it don't, it don't. But they like a numbers guy though? Question mark. I had to explain it. All right, look. Anyways, bro. That whole month I was going to school, bro. I was the man, bro. I was really the man, like, bro. I would, bro. People know I got, bro. First of all, girls is snaky. They know I got a girlfriend. They will come up to me, hey, Rod. Once you, once you don't, it's Rod, nigga. Like, my mom screamed my name to come eat, and, and when she whooped my ass, it's, it's Rod. That's it. When you say, hey, Rod, you drag it, Rod. Like, I automatically, like, <laughs> like yo, I automatically, you feel me? I automatically, like, yo, I'm trying to tell you. I automatically think you fucking with me. You feel me? I automatically think you flirting with me. Bitches is saying, hey, Rod. I'm like, oh, yeah, I'm in it. So, boom, I'm going to school every day. I'm going to school every day. Niggas is fucking with me. Even the hating niggas. When they try to when they try to uh beef with me or they try to fight, like niggas, niggas was like trying to fight all the time. And it wasn't it wasn't unrealistically trying to fight. It was just on the type of time. Like the niggas that didn't like me, they used to just walk by, look me up and down and shit like that. It's like, come on, bro, you wasting your energy to move your fucking bone to look down at my shoe to pick that shit back up, to look to the top of my head. You just wasted two motions. I would never. That's like me seeing an ugly bitch, and I'm just like, like, why would I even look at her? She ugly. Why would I, if I see your face, why would I even look at your shoes? You know it's me. It's the same nigga that you hate every day. Why would you stop to look at my shoes and look me up and down? You're just trying to beef, right or wrong. You just wasted two emotes. You just, you just switched your emotion. Y'all just went from cracking the fuck up with each other as friends to switching your emotion because you walking past me. Why are you even wasting that much energy? That's so pressed. That's pressed as fuck, bro. That's like... The fuck? Why would you even do all that? But, you know, them niggas hating on me, they can't even get past me. You know why? Because when I say I was in my prime, bro, not only was everybody fucking with me, the teacher was fucking with me, bro. You feel me? My teacher, my homeroom teacher, the teacher I come from, come... Too for uh, advisory in the beginning of the um, you would have lost what the fight if they would have jumped me yeah if they would have jumped me I'm not gonna lie when things are going good I know you're supposed to enjoy it but I always think how I can keep it going so that month that whole month I was feeling good I made that happen if I was a regular nigga and I was thinking niggas was fucking it's like boom once you realize like yo you in your prom you bust jokes some more. You start, you start flirting with the bitches more. The niggas that's hating on you, you ignore them more. You do all that. That's what you do. You up it. You up it. So, so when you ask that, it's like, yes, fuck yes. You feel me? You got to make sure you do that. But be, boom, hold off on the story. You got to sub, bro. Make sure y'all sub so y'all not getting them ads, man. Y'all got to stop getting them ads. Them ads hitting y'all hard as shit. Them shit hitting y'all like Javante Davis shots, bro. Y'all getting hit with five ads. Y'all can't see shit. Y'all got to sub, bro. I need y'all to sub. It's $6. I know, y- I know y'all spent $5 on a, on a cheesesteak platter. Y'all got to sub real quick. Fuck with me. Support, support a nigga. Support a nigga real quick. Sub. It lasts 30 days. I ain't telling you pay $6 a day. I said a, a month. A month. You feel me? That's it. But, you know. Anyways, bro. I'm chilling, bro. You feel me? The girl I date don't go to the school, but it, it just felt like everything was good. My teachers is treating me nice and all that. I'm going to keep it a buck. A cheesesteak platter like 10 now, bro? Damn. A cheesesteak platter $10 now? 
No. I ain't had poppy stir food in a minute. They $10 now? Wow. It's a steak shortage? Were we running out of bread or something? Why the fuck is it $10? Steak shortage. Beef and steak aren't. They said they said beef and steak are not facing major shortage. Why the fuck is shit ten dollars? Oh, they just drawing. Oh, they just wilding. Oh, so they think they could just do what they want. Okay. <laughs> ten dollars is average now. You behind. Look, that just that just supports my claim even more. Y'all paying ten dollars for them high ass play, for them high ass platters. Drop six dollars to sub to my channel, man. <laughs> That's high as fuck. I'm not gonna lie. That pandemic, damn. I remember when we was joking when we y'all y'all remember that clip that went around where where a nigga paid seven fifty for a hoagie and he was like, yo, this a Gucci hoagie pop. Them bitches Gucci now on a regular day basis. Them bitches expensive. Damn. Inflation a bitch. Don't let me catch inflation. Whoop his ass. Anyways, or I tell Drewski to call me. Do Drewski follow me? Who told you I knew Drewski? And if I did, why would he call you? Bro, tripping. You're tripping, bro. Chill. Y'all can't be real. Y'all can't. Anyways, these niggas is not real humans, bro. <laughs> can't be. Um. <laughs> Yo, Drewski, a nigga in my life said call him. These views gotta be fake, bro. <laughs> I be thinking these sometimes. Sometimes I zone out and I look at these cameras. And I'm like, bro, who's really watching me right now? This shit is crazy. Anyways, look, back to the story, bro. Life going good. Like I already told y'all, man. Life is going great. But this one shit took a turn. This one shit took a turn. I'm three weeks in. I'm three weeks in to life being good. Oh, 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 oh. Hold up. The camera just froze. The camera just froze. Camera just froze. I look, I'm like, damn, I'm I'm praying, I'm staying pretty still. All right, there we go. All right. Anyways, I'm three weeks into my prom, man. Everything going good, and a nigga is hating on me. You know when somebody hating on you, they hating on you. You can feel when a nigga hating on you. I'm going to keep it a buck. The more that you hang around people that genuinely want the best for you, when, 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 you, when you feel a nigga come around, you gonna know if he hating, bro. You can just see it. People be so transparent, bro. Somebody is hating on me in a room, but I don't know who it is. After lunch, I go into my homeroom class, and they say, yo, Rod, you sending out nudes? I'm like, huh? Nudes? Now, y'all, me personally, I never took a picture of my dick. And sent it out. To the nigga that send the to the all the niggas that send nudes. I don't even know why y'all even do that. Even girls who send a picture of they cooch, it's like, why are you doing that? Why are you taking that picture? Some people, I feel like that's only older people. Older people be like, don't scroll too far. Why? Are you taking pictures of your your, your fucking pussy? Weirdo, why are you doing that? 
Like what? Bro, it's genuinely weird. It's weird. It's like, do you... I hope you're not doing that. Why can't I scroll? What's in here? It should never be nothing crazy, bro. It shouldn't be crazy. You're too old for that. And if you're young, you're too young for that. I feel like it's something that should never... Nudes? It's like, whoa. And then for the niggas that ask for them... What are you doing with the picture? Are you beating your dick to the picture? Genuinely, this is a genuine question. You ask a girl to send a picture of her private part, what are you doing with it? I respect you more if you told her to come over your house. That's exactly what they do. Can you... Ugh! I be sending videos of me jerking my shit. Oh my gosh, bro. Are you serious? Bro, what? What? Wow. It's more common than you think. Wow. Y'all nasty, bro. Y'all nasty. I don't see, I don't see, I don't see the joy, I don't see the joy in it, bro. Just come fuck me. If we want to fuck each other so bad, come fuck me. That's it. Simple. Simple. If, if I want to fuck you bad, bro, I, that means I'm going to find a way to, to get you over to my house. That's all. I'm not going to say, yo, send a picture. Like, just come over to my crib. What are y'all saying pause for? I'm not, obviously, I'm not talking about a nigga. We need the girls to come over, duh. It's easier to send a pic? Fuck no. Fuck no. Just have a girl come over, bro. <laughs> Mm-mm. I call you Uber. We could bust it up, eat, and fuck. That's, that sound, that sound nice. You feel me? Even with a pic, it's like, do you... All right, look, let me ask to the people that say they send these pics, right? It's a it's a until I see you thing. I know, but it's just like, you trust somebody with a picture or just, just your, your pussy? Huh? My thing is, a lot of people get leaked. How do you feel after that video of you playing with your pussy comes out? For the ladies. Does, 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 do you now feel bad? Do you now feel like horrible about yourself? I don't, me personally, if, if you're a lady that's willing to send a picture of you playing with your pussy, we're done. Now I see if you if you trying on some some panties and new bras and shit and, or or you you might send a little picture where you just got out the shower with the towel on. It's like, oh she trying to be cute. You send a picture of you playing with your pussy, we're done. We're done. Automatically. I already know what type of girl you is. And now it's like, yo, I can't. I can't date you. I can't date you because Ladies, don't listen to Rod. Keep playing with that cat. <laughs> oh, my fucking gosh. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Anyways, bro. A, a niggas is asking me like, yo, Rod. Pussy videos are the last level. If you send a picture of you in panties and bras, that's cool. Ass out with the pussy showing, though. No, <laughs> kid, that's crazy. I'm sorry. I was about to get off it, but that's crazy. Like, and then for the niggas, it's like, yo, you're you're entertained by her washing her boobs. Come on, bro. We that horny? No, we can't be that horny as a society. I know we better than this. I be hoping. I be like, yo, we're better. I know we better. I pray for shit like this. I know. I pray that we not that horny. We're not that horny. We're not that horny. We're, we're that horny? Yes? Yes? Yes?
Yo, that's crazy. <laughs> Last question, I'm going to switch, bro. Last question, I'm going to switch. Are y'all niggas jerking off to, to titty videos? Keep it a buck. Right now, just yes or no, and I'm going to stop talking about it. Are y'all, yes or no, tell me the truth, and don't lie to me. Because what are you doing with it? Yes. Wow. Okay. Okay. I don't, that can't ever get me. That wouldn't be, that wouldn't be like, that couldn't do it for me. Wow. Did it before I watched this live. <laughs> Let's get back to the story, bro. I'm done with these questions. Y'all crazy. Anyways. Beating my shit with no lotion. <laughs> Yo, anyways, look, anyways, 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 switch topic, switch topic, switch topic. They asking me like, yo, Ra, you sending out nudes? Yo, bro, they just leaked your dick on a page, just in a third, just in a third. Y'all, everywhere I go, niggas is not laughing at my jokes no more. Niggas telling me, pick your head up, king. You know it's bad when a nigga say king at the end of the sentence. His, the African in him kicking. He called me king. He gonna try to uplift me. He gonna uplift me because he feel like I'm down. Nigga told me pick my head up. I'm like, huh? Nigga said, yo, be good, bro. F fuck that bitch. Apparently on some fake page, right? On some fake page. Oh, I thought I was banned. Why y'all say they about to ban me? Get off TikTok, you finna get banned. If they ban me, come over to the Twitch. Let me just let me just finish, y'all. Let me finish. Let me finish. You got three minutes. Are they are they showing you a timer? Are oh, they gonna ban the account? I'm getting off, so I don't get my man's account banned. It's fake. They lying. I'm fried, bro. Fuck y'all talking about. Anyways. Yeah, whatever. Bro, about to say, when when has it been a timer? What the fuck? If they ban me, just come over to my Twitch. Oh, shit. Abnormal, thanks for the sub. Appreciate you, bro. You know I love your beats, too. But anyways, yo. They like, yo. Just that in the third. The fake page basically posted some... Bro, first of all, I know I'm black, but who gonna tell... How y'all gonna decide... When y'all looked for the pic to say it was me, they looked... I, they had to search blackest dick in the world. Because... No homo. I'm like, what? Let me see. I go on the page. It's some little ass... Little ass black ass... Thing on the page. And the caption gonna say... Damn, right. They saying your shit small. So I'm like, what? Now I'm pissed. I'm pissed because girls is walking past me like this. Like, bro, it's like a movie. Imagine imagine the iPad is a book. Girl walking past me like. Start walking faster. My teacher. Hey, pull me out of class. You think we can talk to you? All day, bro. All day. Niggas, niggas telling me, yo, bro, it's going to be cool. This stand the third, he pulled me in a joint. He said, yo, it's very inappropriate. I'm going to have to suspend you for three days. It's very inappropriate for for you to be uh, basically airdropping a picture of yourself throughout the school. A nigga is in school airdropping. And he went to, and he switched his name to Rod. So now, now it's saying Rod is airdrop. I'm, I'm looking at the nigga like, why would I airdrop a picture of my dick? What the fuck are we talking about? I'm literally, I'm, I'm like, what the fuck are we talk? The fuck are we talking about? I'm like, bro, you're not suspending me. He like, uh, we have to. The whole school's talking about it. You're distracting every class. Just that in the third. I'm thinking, like, what the fuck is going on? My man is right next to me. My man is right next to me. I'm asking him. I'm like, bro, who run this page? Find out who run this page. Find out who run this page. I'm searching up on on uh, on on Google how to get a page deleted. I'm sitting here. I'm like, yo, what the fuck, niggas? Is, am I do? 
the only way I would be able to prove, like, yo, it ain't you is to pull your dick out. And if you pull your dick out, it's a lose-lose, bro. Because I already thought about that method. I'm like, damn, I could pull my dick out. Personally, I don't have a small dick. You feel me? So I'm like, bro, I'm about to, some bitch try hitting me with the, what, boy, don't get smart with me, little ass dick, just in a third. I wanted to say, bitch, what? Pull, what you say, bitch? What? 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 Say it again. Say it again. Say it one more time. I went, I'm like, yo, this bitch say it one more time. I'm a, bitch. Bro, this bitch was getting under my skin, too. I'm not gonna lie. This bitch was getting under my skin. You saying pause like you was the girl. Fuck out of here. Tell my pause. I'm sitting here. I'm like, bro, this bitch made me want to pull my pants. I pull my pants out. It's gonna be a lose-lose. Why? Because it's actually not normal, and it is humiliating to actually just show your dick. So now, it's no way to, for me to say, like, yo, you mean. So, he didn't suspend me because I called my mom. I told her it's not me, whatever. My mom, like, it's not him. So, so now, uh... Yeah, my mom, I, I'm like, mom, it's not me. Why would I do that? That's weird. My mom believed me. And she like, y'all not suspending my son because y'all can't prove it's him doing that or this, that, and the third. So they didn't suspend me. Next day I go to school, my clout is going downwards. It's going down. I don't even know why it would go down, bro. I don't even know why it would go down, bro. It wasn't me. Who the fuck would do that? So now the page just dicking me, bro. The page is dicking me. Y'all know why the page dicking me? Oh, they just banned a lot. The page dicking me because people unfollowed you. Yes. They unfollow me. I tag my mans or something. He, 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 he ain't even reposted. Like, bro. Yeah, the TikTok got banned. I got my peaches out in Georgia. I got my way from California. I bring my shit up to the north, yeah. Here from TikTok. All right, see no more. Hold on, hold on. Let me see if I go live on a different page. Let me get off the Wi-Fi so they don't ban my IP. Hey, y'all. Uh, boom. Dick D. New page. All right, anyways. Anyways, let's get back to the story. I don't know how you're getting out of this one, gang. Bro, they smoked me, bro. I'm asking my I'm asking my man, I'm like, bro, find out who did it, whatever. This then a third. I come to school, my shit is declining. My shit is declining. Bitches stop fucking with me. They text my girlfriend, sent her the page. Once they sent her the page and all that, we ain't never do nothing sexual yet. So she can't ever say that's not him or this is him. Now she ducking me a little bit. She I'm like, yo, you gonna stop I'm like, that's not me. You gonna stop talking to me because of that? You feel me? She like she like, yeah, I don't know. That that's weird that they did that. But now she texting back less and all that, bro. It felt like it felt like I got blackballed, bro. It felt like I got blackballed, bro. I'ma keep it a buck. That shit did not feel good. At first, I was about to let that shit defeat me. That second day, it did defeat me, y'all. It defeated me all the way. It defeated me all the way. I'm walking around school. I'm not talking to nobody. I'm not talking to nobody. Nobody talking to me. The niggas that the niggas that don't fuck with me, they looking at me and they like, they looking at me and they like, yeah, weird ass nigga to stand the third. I ain't even argue with them niggas because I'm like, if I fight these niggas, it's gonna make it seem like I'm doing the uh, doing a lot because it's gonna be like, damn, I just got I just got fake leaked. Now I'm fighting. That shit start cooking me. Late at night, bro, I'm sitting there and I'm like, bro, I'm about to find out who did this shit. I go on the page and I'm looking at every page because now they make making post every day. They make making post every day. Next post, bro, really thought uh, he really thought he was going to get away. He really thought he was going to get away with doing this, that, and the third. Hold on, let me zoom the camera. You said it's too far. I got you. He really thought he was going to get away with doing this, that, and the third. Or you feel me? The next post, oh, he not so funny now. This, that, and the third. Whoever doing it really hate me. You feel me? They really hate me. Whoever doing it really hate me. So I'm looking. And I'm trying to look who they follow. They follow zero people. I'm like, fuck. That's usually where they fuck up. You feel me? I'm looking at the comments. All people, people, all the people from my school is in the comments. They in the comments just supporting this shit. They not saying nothing. I'm just looking in the comments. Then I did, I did my math. I grabbed a piece of paper. I said, let me see who comment on every video. So out of 30 comments on, on each post, and that's like four posts. It's six people that comment every time. 
Let's write their names down. Boom, 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 boom. Right? So now we got six people. I said, we're going to start here. Now I look at the six people and I say, hmm, let's go to their page. I felt like the person that did this, the way they was typing, was a boy. They was typing and I knew they was a boy. They, they were saying like, he did that in the third. Or, or I will fuck him up. A girl wouldn't say, a girl wouldn't say, I will fuck him up. They wouldn't be thinking about fighting me. They would be thinking about getting somebody for me. So now we cut it down. Boom, it's four people. Right? So I'm like, okay, four people left. With these four people, the next day, these four people are supposed to be cool with me. These are four people that I talked to, and they basically said, yeah, you know, uh, yeah, bro, it's cool. Don't worry about that shit. Just stand the third. They told me all that, right? So all that's cool and fine. That's dandy. Cool. I go up to the one boy. I say, yo, bro, can I use your phone to call my mom? They suspended me. This is the story I made. So, right, why would you lie and say they're suspending you? A lot of said they suspended me because whoever made that page want to see my downfall. So if I go up to them and I and I tell them about a down a false downfall, then they're going to be happy to help me. If I say, "Can I use your phone?" They probably say, "Nah, maybe not." If I say, "Can I use your phone?" I'm about to get expelled. They're gonna say, "Yeah, bro, damn." But in the back of their head, they're gonna be smiling. So now I'm on a type time. Like, okay, let's see. So I actually see their phone. When I actually see their phone. I do this. I act like I'm calling. Act like I'm calling. And then I say, yo, they not answering. I'm going to call my I'm gonna call my dad, all right? As I'm acting like I'm typing, boom. I go to the Instagram. I go to each account. Nope. Lock it. Here you go. Next person. Go to second boy. He would not let me see his phone for shit. I'm like, it's him. It's him. It's him. A whole day go by because I kept trying to see his phone. Now he wanted, He know I want to see his phone. So I can't use the whole, yo, I'm calling this, that, and the third, this, that, and the third. All right? Every time, he and my advisory, every time we advisory, in the morning, early, early in the morning, we sit in a circle, and when we sit in a circle, we talk about um, we talk about how yesterday went and what's one thing we could do to improve our grades, what class is going to work for us to stand the third. People come, they sit, they be late to stand the third, all that's going on. While all that is going on, I see the boy. I'm waiting for him to lack. When you watch somebody every move, they actually make a lot of mistakes that, that's not really mistakes, but they make a lot of mistakes. I'm looking at it. I'm waiting for him to, like, sit his phone down. I'm waiting. I'm like, bro, when you sit your phone down, I'm going to take that shit. I'm just going to take it. You feel me? When you watching somebody every move, you going to catch him doing something. You feel me? When you being a stalker. Bro, we, uh, we midway through class. The nigga, the nigga set his phone in his chair. He get up and he go to the front of the class. I grabbed it without remorse. I grab it without remorse because if I'm trying to be sneaky, I'm wasting time. I walk right up to it and grab it. When you do something confidently like you mean it, less people pay attention. When they notice your body language is, is being sneaky or trying to do something else, they pay more attention to you. I grab it confidently. Unlock it. Go to his page. It's not him. Why are you acting like a bitch? He come back. Yeah, bro, why you on my phone? I said, I don't give a fuck, nigga. I was checking your shit. Take your phone. Y'all, that was one of the worst mistakes I could have did. That's one of the worst mistakes I could have did because somebody in that room, I'm not going to tell y'all now, but somebody in that room was the person doing it, and they saw that I was going through phones. They saw I was going through phones. So it's two more people to go through. I don't know the person that was in that room was one of the people. I don't know that he know or nothing. I don't even know I alarmed him. That's where I made my first mistake because I was too loud about going through his phone. The third person gave up his phone with ease. I, you know how people is. You know how, oh, if I ask my dad for this, he'll give it to me. Or if I ask my aunt for this, he'll give it to me. But if I ask my mom, she won't. But if I ask this person this, they will. Like, you know how everybody is. The third person, I know if I already asked to give him, like, let me see your phone, he's going to give it to me. So I say, let me see your phone, bro. He said, for what? I say, I think it's you. He said, oh, it ain't me, bro. Take my phone. He give it away willingly. Boom. Now, I already got the possibility in my head, like, bro. Obviously, somebody could have logged off, but I still need to go through what my original investigation so I could already wipe that clean off the board, right? The last person is my homie. I know it's not my homie. I know it's not. I grab my homie phone. You feel me? I say, yo, bro, let me see your phone. He says, say no more, bro. He unlock it. He go to do something else. I check his phone. Boom. It's not him. It's not him. So I say, damn, what's going on? Day four, I'm still on it. Why? Because people are still talking about it. They're still talking about it. Everybody going on about it about their lives. Like when something messy happened or something something bad happened, and something bad happened, like they might forget about it. They might forget about it or they might stop talking about it every day. But anytime you yourself try to interact, they remember 
automatically. You feel me? Automatically. I go back home, I'm looking at the page, I'm like, damn, I can't figure this shit out. I'm like, fuck, I cannot figure this shit out. Right? Next day I go to school, I figure it out. I'm going to tell y'all how. I get to school and I'm sitting there, I'm like, damn, bro, I just got to take my L. And then something told me. Let me put some ears out. Let me let me make sure let me make sure I'm I'm hitting all bases. So I tell this girl that I really fuck with me. I say, "Yo, bro." And she cute too. She look good. I be trying I was trying to get her. Like I was trying to bag her, but my chances went down once that picture got leaked. So I'm like, "Let me let me just do something else, right?" So I say, "Yo, I need you to do me a favor." She like, "What?" I said, "I need you to hang with them niggas over there for me. The niggas that don't like me." I said, "Hang with the niggas that don't like me today and see if they talk about like if if one of them got the page and then let me know." Because once I find out who got the page, I'm going to beat you the fuck up. And I'm going to expose who actually got the page. And I'm going to expose that you're a weirdo who found a random picture of a private part and then said it was me. And once I find that out, it's over. You feel me? It's over. I'm going to end it. Once, if I can find out, it's over. So I send her over there to do that. While I send her over there to do that, my man's like, yeah, bro. What you tell her to do? I said, it's one of them niggas. I know it's one of them niggas, bro. I know it is. I'm like, I know it's one of them niggas. I sent her over there, and they're going to tell her, too, because they like her. They all like her. They think she look good, and they want her, so they're they, they going to spill the beans. I told her, hop on FaceTime calls with them and all that. Find out. She said, I got you. She was really my homie. Literally, did she know I was just her homie because I was trying to, I was trying to uh, fuck with her, too. But that would be my thing, too, on a side note. That's why, that's why you can't let your girl have boy best friends. Girls don't know, but, like, yo, it's really, really rare that a nigga... Is only your friend to just be your friend. It's rare. And you know how rare it is? It's so rare that a nigga can only be your friend to be your friend and start liking you after. That's why it's dangerous. It's so dangerous because a nigga could not like you for a year and start liking you on the 366th day. Like, you feel me? So it's like, bro, that's why I don't trust the boy best friend shit. Even if he never liked you, it's like, oh, he never liked me. We've been, we been, oh, we've been friends. Uh, just that in the third, all uh, this. And he, he might, he might just start liking you. Like, it just, it, it, it get weird. But. Anyways, I send her over there. She doing that. My man's like, yeah, why you send them over there? You feel me? Why you send her over there? I'm like, yeah, I sent her over there because I know it's one of them niggas. Once she find out, I'm going to beat them the fuck up. You feel me? I'm going to beat them the fuck up. So the whole day going by, she like, yo, it's definitely not him. I checked his phone. She like, yeah, it's definitely not him. It's four of them niggas. She, she, she breaking them down one by one. She let me know. I'm like, ooh, as soon as I find out who these niggas is, I'm going to beat them the fuck up. I'm ready, bro. I'm like, yo, I'm thinking about how I'm going to punch him all that. I'm thinking about how I'm going to punch all of this. I actually didn't find out on this day. I actually didn't find out on this. Right? She said, yo, I'm on FaceTime with the third boy right now. I think I got something. I said, what's going on? She like, yeah. He's saying he know who did it. I'm like, all right, keep asking. Keep asking. Yo, that night, I'm hitting push-ups. I'm hitting push-ups. I'm like, yo, whoever do, bro, whoever did this shit, I'm going to fuck them up. I'm hitting push. Bro, you know you a young boy when you do push-ups the day before, like them Jones going to help you. Uh, side note to all the yumbos who think that shit help, it doesn't. You're actually uh, getting your bones sore. It actually t it takes time for the muscle to build up fr from the push-ups you do that night. It it's going to take about three days to settle in. So you're actually just making your muscles more sore for the fight. Don't do that. If you're going to train, train ahead of time. It doesn't work. Um, yeah, that's just it. But um, on a side note, on a side note, I'm like this. I'm like, yo, tomorrow I'm going to fuck these niggas up. Right? Boom. As she telling me, like, yeah, I think I know. Just that in the third. It might be the third ball. Let me check on the fourth ball. Some nigga tell me, like, yo, right, that really wasn't you? I said, no, it wasn't me. He like, yeah, bro. I know a way to find out who it was. I say, how? He said, related accounts. You can see what accounts is related to what. I said, oh, bet. So I look up related accounts, right? When I look up related accounts, it said, uh, if you make one account and you make it on the second phone, they're all uh, mashed together. So I said, bet. 
So what I did was I went on that page, right? I went on that page. And when I went on that page, I said, hmm, I'm going to block all 30 people one by one. And when I block them, I'm going to go to that page. Because when you click block, it's a block or do it, it's a block all pages, including pages that they make or pages that's linked to them. So if you block one person, it blocks their spam or any page that was made on their phone. So I said, I'm going to go through the comments. I'm going to block every single page one by one. And then I'm going to go back and I'm going to look and I'm going to see when it disappears. So all day, I'm doing it. One, block. But we're not allowed to have our phones out. So now I'm sneaking doing it, right? Block two, go. Nope. Block three, nope. Four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I said, damn. By the time I got to eleven, I said, damn, this shit probably don't work. I said, yo, bro, I'm about to block you real quick. Let me see if your spam disappear. I blocked my mans and his spam disappeared. So I'm like, oh, it does work. Cause I didn't block your spam, so it worked. So I keep going. Block, block, block. I get to 30. And it's nobody that's in the comments. It's nobody that's in the comments. So I'm like, wow. The person, because you, you got to think about it. When you make a fake page, what's the best way to cover yourself up, right? The best way to cover yourself up is to make the page, then go on your real page and go comment it on there. Because I know if everybody in the school is interacting with the page, you know about it. If everybody know, it's like, you feel me? Something is telling me, bro, they're in this comments. I'm like, bro, they're in this comments. Something is telling me, bro, they're in the comments. I'm like, I don't know what it is, but they're in the comments. I know they is. I know they is. I know they're in the comments. When I'm thinking, yo, they're in the comments. Something tell me. Bro, it's somebody that's helping you. It's somebody that's helping you. And, and I know that's somebody that's helping me because... Every time I get a step close, every time I get a method that sounds like it's going to work, somebody pushing me off track, either the girl or my mans. So I said, y'all need to investigate the people close to me. Y'all know, y'all know anytime your phone is going, it's the nigga that's helping you look for it. Anytime money is missing, it's the nigga that's, huh? What's going on? Oh, what? Money? Yes, nigga, money can be stolen. Duh. Why are you so suspicious? Come here real quick. You know, you know, it. who ate my food? Your mom screaming, who the fuck ate my food? It be the nigga with the saudiest mitt. What food? That's what I do. It's two people that's helping me. It's my close mans, it's the girl, and it's the other nigga. The nigga that told me related accounts. It's somebody that's giving me advice. Who's constantly giving me advice? These three niggas. I'm like, okay. These three niggas constantly giving me advice. I know what to do. I blocked the girl. It don't work. As I'm blocking, my man's telling me, yo, I'm not going to lie. It's somebody close to you. <laughs> okay. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. You getting nervous. He getting nervous. Ooh, you know when you getting crept up on. You know when you getting crept up on. When it's getting close, when it's cracking down, you get nervous. I look at him and I say, yo, bro, you know if it's you, I'm going to fuck you up, right? He say, bro, I would never do you like that. I said, okay. He's shaking. I know he's shaking. I know he's shaking. His heart beating fast as shit. Doom, 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 I know his heart beating. I know his heart beating. I would never, bro. Okay. All right. Bet, 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 bet. I said, yo, I ain't never going to block your account. I trust you. I'm going to do the other nigga first. All right? And then I'm going to do your account. I'm going to do your account third. He said, all right, bet. Before I could block the other nigga, he walked up to us. And he's like, bro, I know, I know another way to help you. Boom. He automatically helped my mans because when he said that, now I'm like, whoa, which one of y'all is it? 
Because why y'all trying to help me so bad? This was five days ago. This not y'all legacy y'all got to protect. This mine. We never been that close. Y'all was only dick riding me because I was popular. Which one of y'all is it? So now they throwing me off. Now I realized, don't talk about your plans with nobody. Because when you talk about your plans to somebody, you're giving intel. You don't know who they're talking to. And that then ruins the plan. So my next plan. So now I'm off of this blocking shit. The blocking shit could have been the way that I, I, I found out, but I'm off of the blocking shit. Now, once y'all find out at the end, the blocking shit would have automatically got it faster. But now I'm on a type of time like, okay, okay. I'm like, okay, I got you. I got you. It's one of y'all two. I got you. You in the room. You're in the room. You close. When I find out my enemy's close, I need to get closer. I need to see who it is. I need to. So I say, bro, let me see your phone. What you need my phone for, bro? I already showed you my phone. I, sh I, 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 I shut the fuck up. Let me see your phone, bro. You, let me see your phone. Both of them acting crazy. Unlock it. Unlock it. Unlock your phones. Before I even go through it, I'm looking at them. They both look nervous. I'm like, fuck y'all duo. Fuck y'all duo with me. F like, first of all, you got to do the obvious check. When you, when you avoid the obvious check, you automatically put yourself at a disadvantage. You always got to do the obvious first. I go to Instagram. I check the Instagram. They're not logged in, obviously. Y'all making sure when y'all when y'all around me, y'all making sure when y'all around me, y'all logged out. That's what you got to do. Duh. Okay. All right. Boom, 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 boom. I go to their settings. Boom. Click settings. I click pa passwords. Boom. Click passwords. Unlock your phones. I scroll down to Instagrams. I scroll down to Instagrams. I lock the phone. I say, y'all gonna unlock this phone. Because if you don't, I'm gonna beat you the fuck up. Because that's then saying you're guilty. Before I unlock this phone, do anybody wanna tell me anything? Because once you make an account, y'all know that app will recommend you the, the, the hard password that nobody will ever guess. Or do you wanna save this password? I said, is there anything you want to tell me before we unlock these phones? Because it's going to show passwords. It's going to show every account you ever logged into. Because since you made it off your phone, it was posted around 6, 7 o'clock. So I know y'all was home. So if you made it while you was home, you was under the same IP address that you made your main account on. So it's then linked to your phone. When I unlock it and I click passwords, it's going to show the pages you logged into. Do anybody want to tell me anything before I make y'all unlock these phones? Nigga said, bro, I would never. Other nigga said, bro, unlock the phone. I said, bet. Unlock y'all phones. I look. My mans start running out of the classroom. My mans start running out of the classroom. My mans start running out of the classroom. Wow. <laughs> Yo, you bitch ass nigga. I look on his passwords and it says the page. Wow, my man's who was next to me the whole time. But I don't chase him. No, 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 no. I don't chase him. I can't chase him. I won't. I can't. I can't. I can't. You know why I can't chase him? Because it's better things. He already unlocked his phone. I'm already in it. I click passwords and I log in on my phone. It come over to his phone. Somebody's trying to log in. I click accept. I'm now into the page. I lock his phone. I throw it against the wall. I crack it. I got to see you. We go to school every day. I have to see you. I have to. I have to see you. I will see you. We go to the same school. We're in the same advisory. I literally see you at the end of the day and the morning. And I have math with you. Why won't I see you? You're not going to drop out. Your mom won't let you. I'm going to fuck you up. I log into the page. When I log into the page, guess what? Guess what? When I log into the page, guess what? Guess what? Guess what? The nigga was so nervous. The other nigga was so nervous because he was texting the page being Joe. That nigga thought he was so funny. These two niggas busting it up. The nigga that was, that was telling me how to get in there, he didn't know that he owned the page. But the nigga that did own the page did know that he was dicky in him. 
That nigga think he's so funny. That's what he get. He be art. Right. <laughs> I said, bro, I'm gonna see you after school. I start jogging out of class to look for the for the uh for the uh the counselor. I look for the counselor. I said, sir, where's the principal? He said the principal's in the room. I said, okay, I need both of y'all. Y'all come walk with me. They walk with me. They said, where are we going? I'm looking in each classroom. I'm looking in the bathroom. I'm looking. I'm looking through each classroom. I go to the downstairs bathroom. They following me. The guy was in the, uh, the, the, the nigga that ran, my man, he's in the bathroom. Automatically. A straight punch. Boom! Punch him right in his face. Boom! 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 I'm hitting him hard as shit. I'm hitting him hard as shit. Hey, oh, 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 I'm like, I'm not ever going to fight you, bro. I just had to punch you in your mouth. Then what was going on? What's going on? Just stand the third. What's going on? I said, bro, he made the fake page of me. He must have looked up a random picture. You was going to expel me. I mean, you was going to suspend me. And he's the one who did it. I just found it on his phone. That's why he's not in class. He ran from me. Just stand the third. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa. We need to go upstairs. We need to go upstairs. They take both of us. We go into the office. Yeah, I'm posting this third time on YouTube. We go into the office. Just stand the third. They say, yo, we need the other guy in the classroom, too. Bro, he was just dicky, and I don't think he deserved to uh, get suspended for dicky. And but that's what you get for dicky. And you know, dicky and does have consequences. You can't just dicky and think like, yeah, n nothing's gonna come from it. You know, his 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 consequence was suspend uh a suspension as well for dickying. We go into the office, just stand a third. They calling these niggas moms. You know how how embarrassing it gotta be, right? You know how embarrassing it got to be as a parent. Imagine you're a parent, right? Imagine you're a parent and you got a son. Your son took a picture of a a dick and posted it on a fake page and said it was another student. What would you even do to your son? First of all, you're gay. Why would you do that? That's embarrassing. Uh yeah, we don't we don't know what to do with him. Um he made he 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 made another he made a he made another student uh get a write up slip and got him in trouble, which really put us in a bad spot. Uh he continued to post private parts and, and say, you know, that it was another student and we're we're just fed up. We're we're gonna have to suspend him. What would you do? What would you do as a, as the parent? I don't know what the fuck I would do as as a dad. And they telling me my son took a picture of a private part and posted it and was saying it's another nigga. I would probably get you a therapist, bro. And I would think you gay. Genuinely. I would think you gay and I would get you a therapist. I, it's like, why would you do that? The nigga who made the page got expended until farther notice. The nigga who's dicky and got it suspended for a week. And now, my thing is, okay, I caught them. Y'all need to tell everybody that wasn't me. Because... What they did was, you know what the school did that was an L? They told everybody, yeah, leaking pictures of your private part is something that's not tolerated. And for anybody else that thinks it's funny, you, you will catch consequences. So it's like, bro, you said that and you was throwing shots at me when I didn't do. Like, who, who would do that? Who would do that? Who in their right mind would be on a type time like, yeah, let me show my dick. <laughs> On the page and expose myself.
I don't know what the fuck was going on with the parents, but why the fuck would I make a fake page, post a black ass dick, and say, yeah, y'all, look at Rod, and do that to myself? Like, what? Bro. The teachers was, the teachers, uh, the teachers all had, like, at the end of the day, they all gave, like, a little message. You know how they give a little message, like, hey, we won't be tolerating this no more. We won't be tolerating, it, tolerating that. What they did was the teachers basically at the end of the day uh, said, hey, I know, I know y'all noticed that, you know, such and such is not in school with us anymore. Unfortunately, he was behind the page and what was going on with the page. And, you know, did they get the page shut down? I had the password. I deleted everything, and I changed the password. Um... They was like, yeah, uh, he was he was behind the page. That is not tolerated. If we find out anybody do anything like that to humiliate another like student, we will expel you. Basically, they said like, yo, we will expel you if you do that, you know. And I went to the girl and I was like, yo, thank you because she helped me. <laughs> Just in the third, and y'all know after that, niggas had the niggas had the um. The nerve, right? Niggas had the nerve to walk up to me like, yeah, I knew that shit wasn't true, Rod. Or just to normally talk to me like they didn't stop. Bro, niggas, niggas stopped talking to me, bro. Niggas stopped talking to me after that. After the nigga fake, uh, leaked the page, niggas stopped talking to me. Niggas walked up to me like it was cool. Yo, Rod, you coming over to eat? <laughs> the audacity. Yes. That's the word, Audacity. I'm like, no, nah, I don't want to come over to, your pay over to your table, nigga. You wasn't here just fucking with me. Bro, we knew you just in the third all oh, list. First of all, for the boys, for the boys, even if that was really me, no homo. Y'all stopped fucking with me because a, a picture of a dick came out? No homo, nigga. I expect that from the ladies, but for the niggas... It genuinely hurt my feelings because it's like, yo. It, it didn't hurt my feelings that they stopped talking to me. It hurt, it hurt my it hurt my feelings that y'all 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 start talking to me again like we was on talking terms. Why the fuck would we be on talking terms? Huh? Huh? I'm I'm, I'm huh? I'm genuine. It hurt my feelings once they try to talk to me again because it showed like what? Y'all, y'all. Y'all really going like, what, what? Bro, the bitches start talking to me again. And of course, I'm going to talk to the bitches. That's, that's how girls is. Not even like they get a pass, but you feel me? No homo. I'm going I'm to talk to the ladies. But yeah, that's how that shit ended for real. They ended my little streak with that shit, even though it came out that it wasn't me. Niggas, it, it was just too much going on with my name. And that shit just like, that shit just. It just fucked up the motion that I had with being in my prom. So it's like, yeah, Rod funny, and, you know, niggas know that wasn't me. But that whole situation, just being so much around my name, like, boom. The uh, principal apologized to my mother, too. He called my mom. I fuck with him for that because he called my mom and apologized. Because even though I told my mom, like, yo, that wasn't me, you feel me? She was on the type time, like, yo, you shouldn't even be, like, involved with this shit. And I was letting her know, like, yo, niggas is hating. You feel me? Like, niggas really hating. Where the guy that did that at now, he followed me. He followed me. He a supporter, actually. The nigga that did that is a supporter. He watched my videos. I would have to kill his whole family. <laughs> <laughs> like, and then there was a boy behind the page. It's like, bro, not a girl. I expect a girl to do that. Yeah, and then my mom told me you shouldn't ever be in that situation. Like, I was going to be able to predict, like, yo, next week a nigga going to leak a dick pic and say it was me. Like, what? Fuck was I supposed to do? They swear we control the world, bro. Moms be losing their minds, bro. I'm like, what the fuck? Like, what? 
But yo, that's the story time, man. I hope y'all enjoyed it. I'm sorry that the lives got banned. That wasn't me. They banned them bitches. Uh, if you're watching this on YouTube, I need 10K likes. Uh, and I'm and I'm gonna give y'all an animated story time. The animated story time is basically done. It'll be done in two more days. Get this to 10K like 10K likes and I'll drop the animated story time. We're about to start having uh, one animated story time come out every two weeks.